Tragedy strikes Clark County, and the community responds in different ways. Since the 2011-2012 school year, seven Clark County youth, ages 13 through 16, have taken their lives. These tragic events have spurred deep emotions and cries for help. One local teen expresses her cry for help on Tumblr after her friend, Justin Boys, committed suicide. The teen writes, This is just my sixth friend who has committed suicide. It needs to stop. I am slowly breaking apart. It needs to be over already. I need to stop blaming myself. Someone help. Please. I am finally crying out. I need someone. I have no one anymore. This is just all so hard on me. I miss you, Justin. This post, along with the recent rash of suicides, hit home to several local photographers, and they decide to make a difference. I'm Michaela, and I'm from Medvedder City Photography. I'm Kristen, and I'm from OG Photography. And I'm Mindy, and I'm from Mindy Marie Photography. And I'm Lori, and I'm Lori Nicole Photography. Corey, can you give us an idea of what prompted you to start the You Matter campaign? Absolutely. I wanted to definitely start this, and the last thing that I had heard from Prairie was when Justin Boyce had taken his own life, and I remember sitting outside and thinking, this is number four now of this school year alone, and this has got absolutely have to end. I remember being in high school, and I was one of those kids who was terribly bullied, picked on, severely depressed and you know I remember what that's like and I absolutely wouldn't wish that on my worst enemy and knowing now that you know the drugs are getting worse the bullying's getting worse it's like you know maybe there's a reason why that did happen to me and it's to you know become an adult and realize it's like you know what you survived it you can get past it and now let's make a difference. How did the idea for the You Matter fundraiser come about? Uh, the fundraiser campaign came about when the four of us decided we wanted to help. So with us all being photographers, that was the only way we knew we could help, or the best way, I should say, we knew we could help. So it was 20-minute time slots, and people would come out and take one of those slots, and they would make a donation for that time slot. So um, the actual day was in February, and it was raining, snowing, it was freezing cold, and it was really cool, though, because the community still showed up. Um, we had a ton of people and we raised a lot of money for the cause. Can you please explain the You Matter photo campaign? The photo campaign came about right after our first fundraiser. We wanted to come up with a way to get more people involved and to have people be able to create their own way of being a part of it. So what we did was we took photos that included the word I matter, or you matter, or we matter, some sort of that variation of that phrase. And um, we asked people to take their own pictures, to take pictures of themselves, and their friends, their kids, and opened it up and told them to put them on our website and, um, you know, post them, share them. And we got a lot of people that turned in photos. It was really cool. We have probably a couple hundred. The goal is to keep it ongoing. So. We hope to get hundreds and hundreds of pictures of people just spreading the word that they matter and that everybody is important. And um, it's cool because all different styles. We have professional photographers doing it. We have people doing it with camera phones or whatever. But anybody and everybody can contribute, and it's been really cool. And so what we want to do is we want to continue to raise awareness about teen suicide and prevention. We want to help bring resources to people, um, specifically students, and we really are hoping to get into the schools. Um, our goal at, immediately, I would say, is to take the same sort of event that we did and bring it into the schools, to bring counseling, you know, um, people to help with depression, people to educate and everything like that into the schools. The biggest challenge so far with the You Matter event is um, we didn't really take into consideration all the politics and red tape and everything that um, goes on with the school boards and the school administration and stuff. We just thought that we would raise money and we would get in there and help. And um, 
we've learned quickly that it's not that simple. And while they may want help, they don't quite know how to ask or receive it. So we're kind of in the process of working that out and figuring out how we can all work together and do it so that we fall within their guidelines that they have to follow. Um, but it hasn't stopped us. We just decided if we can't do it the way we originally planned, we'll still just do it. And we'll make sure we find a place in the community to accomplish our goal.